Oh, this is Maloney's best effort so far since he came. No. No. He, he's had a lot of good games. In fact, uh, we were talking in the last game. Uh, he only threw six innings and actually could have thrown a lot more, but I had to get a couple other guys in the game, uh, you know, to get innings. So I, w I wasn't able to, but he's pitched well. He's really pitched well uh, since he's been back, as, as good as I've seen him over a period of time. Tonight was one of his better games, and, and I very well could have left him in for the ninth. He had pitches left, but again... You know, we're trying to get it. We got a few other guys that we need to keep on, keep sharp with with work. And you got good hitting from all around today. You know, the Leica and Armida, especially in their spots and the positions there on the order, they really provided. Yeah, I, I thought we had pretty good at bats the, the entire game. You know, we've kind of been a uh, a home run. We've relied a lot on home runs, and, and I thought tonight we did a better job of having quality at bats and and getting some singles and, and putting together strings rather than just going through big ones. And this win obviously helps as you're getting toward the end of the season to stay above 500 to finish the season. This really helps. Well, we're back to that. I don't look at that, that as much as you think. Uh, you know, I'm more focused just on my players and the moves we're going to have coming and all that stuff. And, what, and Phipps has a sore finger? Yeah, he, he's had his his finger's been swollen for a while, and, uh, you know, it puffed up a, a, on him again a little bit. We've x-rayed it, and it's clear, so I just gave him a couple nights off. I mean, he chomping it a bit to play, but, you know, we're at the end of the year, and I, I don't want to push a guy too hard. I'll give him a couple days off. He'll be back in the lineup. He'll be back soon. Yeah, without a doubt. <laughs> uh, you just talk about Heisey a little bit, why he wasn't in the lineup today. Day off. Day off. Uh, yeah, as simple as that. We uh, we had it scheduled, you know, play, you know, three or four, uh, five to six, six to seven, day off, and then tomorrow he'll be back and uh, uh, probably play eight or nine tomorrow. How's he progressing, and what have you like? Well, his, what have he's seen healthy, him? number one. That's the biggest thing. When you have an oblique, your whole mm -hmm. game relies on the middle of your body. So he's healthy. That's number one. Number two, you know, he hit a home run yesterday, and, and you can tell his timing's getting a little bit better, and the fear's gone, the fear of, of that thing cropping back up, playing three days in a row. So it was a good off day today, and uh, he got some work in Cincinnati. They had their team picture today mm -hmm. in Cincinnati, so he was up there for that. Got his off day, got his work up there, and then he'll be back in the lineup tomorrow. Uh, back to Malone. Just what was, how was he going about, you know, his game today? He seemed like he was getting a lot of ground balls. A lot of ground balls. Just, just quality stuff, command of his stuff. Uh, actually, he left the bullpen and, and said, "I didn't have very good stuff out of the bullpen." So that goes to show that the bullpen doesn't always tell you. Uh, he got into the game and he started that game, and you could tell he had good stuff. But he worked both sides of the plate up and down, and mixed his pitches very well. Um, we had Cozart and Mezzarocco named to the postseason All-Star team today. Let's talk about their seasons and you know how great of accomplishment that is for not only them but you as well. Well, I think for for Cozart, you know, I, I'm very happy for him. He's he's quality. He's a he's a quality baseball player. Had a great year last year. Went up to the end of the year and played well for him. Uh, didn't make the club out of spring training this year, but had a very good spring training. And then he got off to a slow start with us. He mm -hmm. struggled a little bit early, but it didn't last long. He got back on his game and uh, got an opportunity to go to the big leagues and played really, really well for them, both offensively and defensively. And then, of course, the injury and the surgery. Uh, but I expect him to be back full speed. And it's, it, it's fun to see good kids like that make it. Uh, and then Mez, Mez has had a great year. Uh, you know, I, he's just had a great year. Uh, he's, he's improved in all aspects of the game, worked very, very hard. He's ready, he's ready, you know, he's ready to make that next step. And this is just another proof that he's ready to play in the big leagues.